Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, for thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Okay, guys, let's see what's going on. Thank you for sticking around for the reading, and I do hope that you guys have a better understanding of what this Twin Flame journey is about and what it requires of the Divine Feminine because it's not just about you healing yourself, but you're the key, you're the leader, you're the answers, you have the answer. So let's see what's going on here guys. Two of Swords, a decision, or someone hiding a part of themselves. The Eight of Wands. Yes. Going to be releasing their emotions. The Eight of Wands is about fast movement. So someone is either has made that decision to get out of that self-entrapment that mental prison that locking away of my heart because I've been hurt and I don't want to be hurt again mode <laughs> and are now gearing up for communication to express themselves of course the page of cups ready to express himself ready to express their emotions the page is something small, maybe a younger male. But they're growing. They're changing. They're realizing that something's wrong and they're changing it. Coming in with an offer. Something small at first, as usual small at first the seven of wands because they were being defensive they were being defensive before guarding their heart not releasing their their emotions not showing you how they feel and we all know that this is how these masculines they operate they never show you how they truly feel until God kick them in the butt and say buddy buddy it's time to wake up See, oh my God, there's a lot of defense going on here. At least they're holding on to their passion, the passion that they have for you to drive. 333, three, three. yeah, divine intervention is going to happen here because these divine masculines, they feel beaten down, but they're not. It's just mental. It's just in their head. Nine, completion. It's just in their head. And they have to get out of their head. They have to get out of their head and look at reality. Take the blindfold off so they can see clearly. So they can know what is wrong, what is right. Because in their head, just thinking about it, wanting to do it, is not going to cut it. They have to identify what's wrong. They have to identify the good, identify the bad. Then they can cut it out. Then they can stop this mental torture. This sadness, this locking away their emotions and come forward with this offer. What else can you tell me, please? Yes, Wheel of Fortune. I love when this card comes in because this shows that destiny is going to step in. I saw that 333 earlier. 
this is God not putting up with their crap anymore. Same buddy, I'm getting a bit tired over here. I've been showing you, I tried to show you, you're not seeing. So now it's time for destiny to take charge. Once you heal and allow healing to occur, then everything will be balanced. Your emotion, your heart, your mind, your soul, everything will be balanced. When you force it, when you force it, five, 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 big changes. When you force it, guys, you're interrupting God's plans. The two of ones in the reverse. Still holding on passionately, but not moving forward. No, no, no drive. Two is about balance, too. So there's no balance. They don't know what to do. They know what they want. They can feel it. And so can you, Divine Feminine, but there is no balance, so they cannot move forward. Whoa, whoa, look at what they're thinking about. The love of their life, their twin flame. This person they have known for many lifetimes. This person they have spent many lifetimes with. Cycles upon cycles upon cycles, going around, going around, going around. This person that they love dearly, that they want to be with. The person that they're going to break chains for, that they're willing to give up tradition for, that they're willing to change the way they think, their spirituality four their divine feminine tower moment i told you when god steps in and god says buddy listen you're wasting my time <laughs> he's gonna send in his army and he's gonna shake things up get rid of that thing that you have around your heart, that barrier. The Divine Masculines are going to learn to remove that barrier from around their heart. Because God is going to step in. Divine Feminines, you're not the only ones tired of waiting. Tired of seeing crap. <laughs> God's tired too. Because you're each other's wish fulfillment, you fill each other's cups. He's there looking for someone to fill his cups, to complete him, to be there with him, to share all these cups with, to converse with. He's there alone. Even if he's in a connection, he's alone. He's, he's emotionally unavailable. Emotionally unavailable. He wants to complete his life. But decisions, decisions, decisions. And here you have the chariot. See, once he gets out of his head, once he starts to trust in God, once he starts to plan, instead of just thinking and thinking for no reason, then here comes my yin yang twin flame card baby here comes the chariot moving forward might be in the planning stages but you gotta start somewhere and here you have the hierophant planning on making that offer that commitment as I said, it may start off small, 
hey just a text message a phone call a visit and you talk plan to talk again plan to meet up somewhere because people are still out there people are still going out there don't think that everybody's stuck in their house because they're not But if my masculine comes around, you gotta stay six feet apart. <laughs> you gotta stay six feet apart and talk to me. <laughs> oh my gosh, what's under there? Four of Pentacles holding on to things that not, that wasn't serving him. His emotions holding it, holding it, holding it when he should have released it, and now he has regrets because he did not accept what or who could fill his cups see the judgment call now now he's making that judgment call one 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 moving away from what no longer serve him moving towards the divine feminine could be a family situation that he's moving away from but he's definitely moving towards his lover his twin flame That's his Six of Cups. And there he is coming in with that offer again, once again. And now he's more mature. He's no longer the page. He's no longer the page. He's the knight. So with something more mature and more stable, he's taking off the mask. He's revealing himself. Conquering his fears. Realizing that he's bigger than his fears. Offering his cup like he should have done a long time ago. And accept the victory that he so longed for. Accepting that victory that he longed for. What is going to tell me in regards to these masculines, please? What else can you tell me in regards to these masculines, please? Six of Pentacles, making things equal, equal give and take. He took all your emotions before. Now he's willing to give it back. See, he's taking his time. As I said, small at first. Hold on, I think I hear a knock at my door. Okay, no. <laughs> He's starting off small. Little by little, giving back. Giving back. Because he has found his answers, the answers that he seeks. The hanged man releasing all those things that no longer serve him, leaving them behind. There was too much interference and he couldn't think on his own, couldn't act on his own. But then when he closed his eyes here and blocked the world out, he went to the higher being, to God. And he prayed and he asked for help, for guidance, protection. And God answered the tower. Once again, God answered his prayers and start to boom, 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 boom. Get out of his life. Get out of his way. You're gone. This is gone. That's gone everything and he's gonna light his fire too he's gonna light his fire the blessed fire that twin flame he's gonna light it inside the divine masculine releasing all the conflict that has been going on inside the masculine all that inner conflict that defense 
that wall that he had up. Love is now going to be able to come in and he's his pain. 15, 15. He's his pain. So he can be happy. So he can move on. So he can plan ahead. Plan for what's ahead. Which is a life with the Divine Feminine. See? Getting ready for that brand new venture. Getting ready for that brand new venture with that Page of Wands. And the Page of Pentacles. Small offers. Small offers at first. 555 five, five, change. Until it gets to the big one. The Four of Wands. That marriage. That commitment. that engagement I'm getting to um, look out for feathers look out for feathers and you may be seeing diamond rings engagement rings even the bluebird even the bluebird that's what I'm getting Let's see what else these divine feminine should expect from the masculines, please. What else should these divine feminines expect from the masculines? When they come back, of course. Oh my gosh. That flew all the way over there. The clover. Good luck. Hope. Have hope. They're coming back. 1707. Your reward. A brand new opportunity. Success. <laughs> yes. When it's happy, I gotta get excited, man. The letter. Expect communication. Expect a message. As I said, they're gonna come back. They're gonna start to communicate. Maybe just a text, hi, a phone call. They come to see you. But they're completing cycles. They're wrapping things up because it's destiny divine timing divine order nothing happens before it's time and here you go the ring with the brand new beginning and the ace of wands divine timing divine intervention that offer putting an end to what no longer serves him yep he made that choice he made the choice. What is it to say? Idea. Idea. Yeah. Well, he did get that idea. He did get those ideas because while he was here in the hermit mode, trying to make a, a choice, that decision, Master God stepped in and said, buddy, listen, I'm here to help you. What do you want? What are your desires? Tell me. I will grant them for you. Well, sir, my desire is to be with my divine feminine, but I don't know how it's... <clears throat> I'm sorry. My desire is to be with my divine feminine, but I don't know how it's going to work. Buddy, 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 be still. And know that I am God. I control all things. I control destiny. Watch me. Boom, 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 boom. And that those aren't, aren't shots, okay? That's the lightning striking on the tower card. Guys. <laughs> here is the ship. He's definitely moving forward. And here is that four of wands, the garden, the marriage, the coming together, the gathering, the celebration. The celebration. Look at that. He's definitely moving forward, ending what no longer serves him. See? Cutting off what no longer serves him. Oh, look at this. 
look how beautiful this is 10 and the 8 is 18 right he's cutting off what no longer serves him and then you have the 18 card coming back coming back being loyal showing his devotion to you don't 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 watch this person behind here they were deceptive they were a snake and they're behind him they're behind him because all they did these are at the top of the deck was cause confusion in his life making things so blurry causing problems dilemmas stealing his money stealing anything that they could to build themselves i'm sure these masculines they work so hard but they don't see where their money is they don't see what they have accomplished because who they have around them is doing nothing good with their money but spending it on themselves or tucking it away for their rainy day and here he is coming in towards the divine feminine again guys you guys are getting your visits 21 12 coming to your residence coming to your home planning to move in together because he's ready he has purged he has released all that that does not serve him and it's time to heal this connection with the divine feminine Let's see what the Romans angels have to say, guys, in regards to this message. Mm -hmm. Chemistry, new love, and flirt. Told you he's coming back. There's a strong magnetic attraction here that he could not run from. That neither of you can run from. Sure, some of you divine feminines can say you want to give up and you go about your business, but trust me, you will always be pulled back. If this person that you are longing for, 2222 just passed. If this person that you're longing for, pining over, is your true tw twin flame, your divine masculine, then when they come, come back, they'll be a new person, transformed. And they will always come back it will not be easy for you to walk away and when I when I say walk away in regards to this situation I mean turn your back say you you can't bother with them they hurt you too much and you're going about your business and that's it that's turning your back on the connection but when you let go you let go and you give it to God and you say God take charge because I can't handle it so I'm gonna do what I can handle I'm going to work on myself while you work on what I cannot. So there's a difference. 23, 23, 5, 5, a big change. Flirt, extend your lighthearted energy to others. Excuse me. Make sure you're in that energy of happiness, joy, peace. Looking forward to success. Because when you do that, you extend that energy towards your masculine. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. You're going to be giving your energy to your masculine. And he's going to borrow that energy. And he's going to use it to escape his prison. Again, it depends on you. Let go of control issues. Wow, what I just said. Don't try to control it. Don't try to manipulate the situation. Once you realize what this twin flame journey is about and what it is required, what is required of you, then you should know that whenever you try to get things done your way, you are trying to control the situation and that everything else should be left up to God. The only thing you can control is yourself. You can't control anybody. But you can control yourself. Everybody else, you leave them to God and God will take charge. Make the effort 
Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. If this love is what you dream of, what you desire, then it's worth taking the steps you're guided to take. If it doesn't mean anything to you, sure, you can go about your business. If you don't care, trust me, your masculine don't care either. Because the energy you put out is what your, your masculine feels. And if he's feeling that you don't care and you don't want him, he will not want you either. So sometimes I see these divine feminines commenting that they don't want their masculines. They don't want to see them. If you put that energy out, what do you think your masculine is going to feel? You think he's going to come begging for you? Hell no. Five, five, five again, big changes. He's going to act accordingly. He's going to act the same way you're acting because you keep forgetting that this person is inside you. This person is inside your heart and what your heart feels is what your, uh, your heart acts off of. If you understand what I'm saying. So you're saying you don't want to see him. Trust me, he doesn't want to see you either. You're saying you don't want him. Trust me, he doesn't want you either. So you have to be careful what you do and say. The divine feminines are the leaders and you manifest what you speak. What you put out, you manifest. Let's get you some messages from this, the keepers of the light. Charity, prayer and contemplation. Connect with heaven, ask and ye shall receive. Didn't they say that's what the masculines did? When God was talking to him and God said, listen buddy, tell me what you want, I'll give it to you. Ask and ye shall receive. You just got to ask. If you don't ask, that means you don't need it. That means you do not need it. Gaia, Earth Connection. Be mindful of the planet. Come back to Earth. Stay focused. Basically, this is saying to wake up. Wake up. Get your head out of the clouds. Focus on reality. Focus on reality. Reality is what counts. Not what is in your thought, not, not, not what you're planning for. Reality. Now. So always live in the present. Not the past or the future, the present. Krishna. Devotion. Trust your spiritual guidance. Your commitment has been recognized. You are loved unconditionally. See, God recognizes you for your effort. And you're going to be blessed gentleness be kind to yourself and others honor your gentleness speak oh what am i reading okay let me finish speak words of love oh my gosh i think i had to say that somehow because that's not the the keepers of the light deck <laughs> anyways on the bottom of the keepers of the light deck is facing fear kalima Major spiritual changes are unfolding. This is your chance to soar. This is your chance to manifest what you desire, Divine Feminine. And the message from the angels who are watching over you, who are helping you through this situation. Teaching and learning, Archangel Zadkiel. Keep an open mind and learn new ideas, then teach these ideas to others. Some of you are teachers in any way, shape, or form once you teach. Clear sentience, Archangel Raguel. Notice your recurring physical and emotional feelings as they signify divine guidance. Spiritual, physical, emotional feelings, they are coming from within. And when it's coming from within, it's divine divine guidance 
crystal clear intention Archangel Michael be clear about what you desire and focus upon it with unwavering faith because he's ready God is ready to grant you the angels are telling you to focus on what you want 3003 because God is ready to grant you your wish and you are safe Archangel Michael I am protecting you against lower energies and guarding you your loved ones and home so if you're worried Oh my God, I split the deck. I split the deck, guys. Victory. Your prayers have been heard and answered. Have faith. I did say he's ready to grant you your wish. He's ready to grant you your wish. Standing by. Ask and ye shall receive. Now, let's use this deck. <laughs> One message, Justice. Let this group know what it is that they should be working on from themselves please that one that i read was to be gentle with yourself miracles have faith that your miracle is on its way oh my god my god my god everything destiny have faith that your miracle is on its way your prayers have been answered. Surrender the how. Oh my God, Divine Feminines. All these cards are telling you to have faith because your prayers have been heard and answered. Trust in God. 31, 31, 4, 4, balance. And look, look, look what's on the bottom again. <laughs> this is awesome. Look what's on the bottom again. And I shuffled. Be kind to yourself and others. Honor your gentleness. Speak words of love. Speak words of love to yourself. You will make it. You just got to be strong. Control your, your anger, your temper. And everything will be okay. Guys, this has been your message. Victory is waiting for you.